Everything in our world and the decisions we make can be considered part of one gigantic mathematical model. Through operations research, we can find the optimal solutions by exploring numerous possibilities. Innovation is something which goes beyond what was already known and used by mankind in certain fields of technology. The higher the technology you wish to improve, the more parallel developments you need, the more players you need in the world who work on all this, because not one person alone, not one company alone can do this. The more patents a company files, the more offers to mankind it makes to share. Tell me a little bit about yourself. I'm Dan Zengang. I got my bachelor's degree and doctorate degree from Tsinghua University. Since joining Huawei, I have worked on the research and algorithm design and planning for supply chains. The physical world around us has limited resources. Considering this, how can we use these resources to achieve the best possible results? This is the focus of my research. We need to consider all available resources and all real-world scenarios to create a mathematical model. Then we must find the right formulas to solve that mathematical model. In this way, we can find the mathematically optimal solution. What's the biggest impact on people's lives that you think your research will have? Operations optimization creates value in many respects. A company doesn't need to expand its facilities or buy more equipment, but the company itself or one of its plants can increase production capacity by 10% or even 20%. You can work much faster when computers are helping you make decisions. Moreover, our world will become cleaner and greener. For example, man-made resources like trains and aircraft are limited. How can aircraft transport more passengers while using less energy? This is about doing more with less. At an airport, a great many resources must be managed. To do this efficiently, we must create the optimal resource scheduling plan. We need to make sure that as many aircraft as possible can park at jet bridges so that passengers can directly board planes. We need to reduce the time each aircraft spends at a jet bridge. We must make sure that passengers board as quickly as possible. These matters require careful consideration and optimization. There is another key challenge faced by airports. Abnormalities are not uncommon. For example, blizzards, storms, and heavy rains. When any of these occur, things can get messy, and we need to adjust a contingency plan. If this plan is adjusted manually, something might be missed because many things need to be factored in. Besides, manual decision-making may take a long time. Our hope is that, when an emergency occurs, we can get everything back on track rapidly through operations optimization. At Huawei, there are tens of thousands of products in production. In the Pearl River Delta in China, we manage several hundred plants. This means several million variables are at play. In my daily work, I have to find solutions within hours. Such solutions specify the plant's production mode for the next day or for a certain period of time. These solutions show how processing orders can be released to the plant. During this process, these solutions create value for us. They help lower the costs of both raw materials and finished products. They also support the rapid shipment of products to customers, meaning products don't sit idle in warehouses. Can you tell me about some of the biggest difficulties you've faced? One of the biggest difficulties is understanding customers' business processes, like those of airports and steel plants. We have to dive into these processes. Another challenge is that we must covert business problems into an abstract math model. The next step is solving the problems. This may involve huge amounts of data. We may need to solve problems using millions of formulas. It all comes down to finding optimal solutions that balance multiple goals. This is a complex undertaking. Our technologies are already being trialed in many industries, like ports, airports, transportation, logistics, manufacturing, automotive, wine warehousing, and steel making. We already have many mature applications and successful experience. We can share this experience with customers in these industries. We hope to help customers improve efficiency, cut costs, or both. We hope that our technologies will see wider adoption. 
So as you know, Huawei are committed to a fully connected, intelligent world. In the scope of your research, what do you see that world to be like? To build a fully connected, intelligent world, we must provide end-to-end -end technology to solve problems and support the entire world. In a sense, the world around us is disorderly, full of irregularities and randomness. Addressing this disorder requires the connection of all types of data and continuous pursuit of optimization. So, our technology provides the means to achieving optimization. This is how my work creates value.